Welcome back to Bay Area Focus. Please welcome Mario Trigueros and Maisa Arias from the Pachamama Alliance educational team. Thanks for coming on the show. Thanks for having us. Okay, first tell me about Pachamama and the mission. Mm -hmm. Well, Pachamama Alliance has a twofold mission. Basically, half of our job is working with indigenous peoples in the Amazon rainforest and empowering them to protect their territories and their culture. And the other part is that based on what the insights that we gain from that work, we inspire and engage people on this side of the world to create a, a good future for all. But you are on the educational team. Mm. So really what your focus, what is your focus and what kind of pro programs do you offer? Yeah, so there are a series of programs. The, we, we've, the one that we really kind of um, really launched us, we've been doing for about 10 years. It's the Awakening the Dreamer, Changing the Dream program. And it's this amazing two to four hour workshop done across the world. It's in person, it's online, just really incredible at uh, waking people up to what's happening in the world, how we got here and what's possible. Now we've got a, si a seven week online course that people are engaging with from across the world, um, deepening that experience. Um, we've got communities both locally, globally, and online to deepen people's experience, keep them engaged, and take them to the next level. Sure, this is a map right here of all of the places you've been, right? Pachamama yes. has been. It's got a global exactly. reach. Uh, this is, yeah, we're in just about every continent. Um, it's really expanded far beyond anything that we could have imagined in the beginning. And talk to me about global communities. What are global communities? Mm. Yeah, so there, there are groups of people, hubs, that use the programs that Mario was talking about. So whether it is Awakening the Dreamer or the Game Changer Intensive, they use them to wake more, more people up, to get more people engaged in the work that needs to be done today to create a new world. And how do you get people involved in this? Mm. And how do you get the word out? Yeah, so, you know, a lot of people are hungry for... Uh, making a difference in the world. Um, it, it, in lots of ways, people find us because they're looking and they're hungry to make a difference with their lives. So uh, we've got a pretty good online presence. There's an amazing word of mouth that happens. Um, but you know, at some point, we the, the trappings of our lives uh, don't feed us in the ways that we hope. And so we, uh, we go out and we, we seek what else is out there. Um, and people find us like that. Um, you've got a friend who's inspired you. Uh, they have friends who they've been inspired by. And that network of people sort of um, elevating their consciousness, trying to align their values with their actions, um, that's a gl growing global community in itself. And in that community, we've got a strong presence, um, lots of partners, um, and so people actually find us pretty easily. But we've got a website, obviously, sure. that people can visit. Um, and as you saw, we've got a global pr presence. So wherever you are in the world, there's some way of getting involved. So it seems that a lot of the people who get involved that you said, you know, they're they're kind of trapped in their everyday right. world and they they look around and say, you know what, something needs to change here. Yeah, and it often kind of begins individually. It, it some, something shifts where um, the the things that sustained you just don't anymore. There's some there's a separation um, from what's important in the world and that cat catapults you into seeing what's actually happening in the world and so those two things of what's happening individually and what's happening in the world um, are what we address in that, that internal journey and the external journey of changing the systems and the structures that actually organize our world are the things that we try and help people through. So give me some examples of that because once they're, they're set internally, then mm -hmm. how, to, how do they act? Yeah. So um, probably the best example of that is the Game Changer Intensive. This is that seven week online course. Um, so the first few weeks are all about um, cultivating those inner resources. Uh, you talked, uh, you mentioned uh, proactivist. We build proactivist leaders. This is an, a centering an action that is for something, that you've got a vision that you move toward. It's so easy to get caught of working oppositionally, uh, working against things. So a few weeks of cultivating that sense of um, developing wisdom, purpose, and intention, and then actually looking out into the external world. So we actually do, um, are engaged in democracy 
equity work here in the states um, and climate change work here in the states. People can get um, get involved in really concrete action wherever they are, doing anything from um, emailing senators, lobbying to um, hosting local group hubs. There are just so many different ways for so many different types of people mm -hmm. to get involved and really give avenues for ways for people to do that. This is only for adults? Um, you know, <laughs> well, you know, there are some yeah. very conscious teenagers and Absolutely. younger children. Absolutely. No, actually, there are the facilitators of the Awakening the Dreamer program. They've managed to create versions of this for younger children, for youth. So, and it happens all around the world for pretty much all ages. Yeah. Oh, yeah. well, that is great. Yeah. Thank you so much for coming on the show and telling us all about Pachamama. Mm -hmm. And for more information on Pachamama, just log on to Pachamama.org. Again, that's Pachamama.org. Love saying that name. <laughs> coming up next, a festival in Golden Gate Park that is delivering a lot of laughs. We'll be back.